Actually, yeah, that's not faster. Okay. Uh, yeah, but it's useful. Oh. We can use this stuff, right? Still have a spear pickaxe, so that's all right. How big? How big is this system? Humongous, trust me. This one seems to go along for quite a ways. Wait a minute, what's this? What's this? Uh, so it's a dungeon. What kind of dungeon? That's the question. I have no idea, but let it up. Take a close look at this corner, you'll be able to see it's a zombie dungeon. Alright. Break the spawner. I heard a zombie fall. You know what that means? You know what? <laughs> there he is. Yeah, there he is, see him? Hi, zombie. Do you want to play? I have a game we can play. It's called Put My Sword in Your Face. Yeah. This is the weirdest looking dungeon I've ever seen, though. Well, yeah, sometimes... It's a dungeon that was... Dungeon. A dungeon that was fragged by a mine shaft that had water in it. This is the water. This is the ocean. Coca beans. Another bucket. Redstone. <laughs> so now I can build that um, piston harbor. Yep. All right. I might as well collect this uh, cool stone. Assuming, of course, that uh, we can actually get at it without it like falling down. I guess we are in the ocean biome. I mean, um, we're down pretty far, and yet there's water, there's sand there. Oh no, I don't want to go down there. I don't want to go down there. You can swim back up. Yeah. I guess you might just want to. You can either block off that ocean, or you can make it into an airlock. You know what I mean by an airlock? Uh, it's one stream of water. So water is the only way up and down, basically. Well, yeah. Stream up and down. You can't make those too long. Otherwise, you'll suffocate before you hit the surface. Now, are these, are these really from springs or from the ocean? Because how high are we actually? This one's for the ocean because we're we're at Wait a minute. Sea daylight, and there's all that sand. Huh, do I, do I risk swimming up there? Well, it's daylight. I mean, the question is, will I be able to find my way back? I know, I'll make the... Oh, God. Uh, well... I'll make the hole bigger. Far away from the house, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God, did you see that? Yeah, I saw it. I was suffocating for a second. I probably am not... Yeah, I'm probably not that far away from the house, now that you mention it. Oh, no, not again. Oh look, iron. All right, come over here, my precious iron. All right, let's swim up. Is this a good idea? I don't know. Oh god, oh god. Let's get there. Let's just take a look around. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Wow. It's right there. Actually, yeah. I will be able to find my way back down because it's dark. Yeah. You know what I could do? I can try to connect this to the other path. See, that's how I found one of the underground mine shafts. All right, here's I what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back down there. Typically and then I'm going to record the coordinates. The coordinate. Whatever you call it. <laughs> All right. The coordinates, coordinate, coordinates. I like coordinates better. Three two seven six y equals forty. Z equals negative nine six nine. So now that we ouch have that all together, swim back up. Break on through to the other side. Break on through to the other side. Okay. Swimming up to the sky. Ooh. <clears throat> Get up there, my little swimmer. Okay. 
Well, here's what we're going to do. We are going to go back in here. Maybe I should drop off some more stuff while I'm here. Mm. Like I have so much coal. Oh yeah, you've got a lot of stuff there. There goes another airplane. All right, I don't need the melon seeds with me or that or that. I don't need the extra bucket. Don't need coca beans. I don't need these fences. I don't need that much wood. <laughs> yeah, when you're down a mine shaft, you can pretty much get the wherever. I probably won't ever have to make another chest again if I keep finding this many chests. All right. Oh my god. You don't know about rail either. Oh, yeah, the rail. Wow, yeah. I have a lot of rail. Where the dun where the uh, mossy cobblestone? Yeah. I can't wait until I transport this to the new uh, storeroom that I'm going to make in the Great Library. A new storeroom? Yeah, I'm gonna make a new one. So we're gonna go down until we get to here. Forty one. And we're going to go in what direction? Uh, we need to go... We need to go this way. Alright, we've got to go this way until we get to... We need to have a network of tunnels under... Um, <laughs> you know, we need to get the future of the stock. Yes, we're going to 69 under here. that... Uh, um, the place where you swing them up, you could just sort of plug them up a little bit. Yes, oh god, what did I just... Oh. A mine shaft. Have I been here before? Yes. Oh, well then, in, in that case, that can be part of my tunnel. So what direction in X do I have to go? Let's see. Only over here. You know what, that's probably good enough. I, I don't need to dig anymore if I have that. So, wow, this is overwhelming, I must say. This is a lot. I really am thinking, though, of taking a boat ride around. Oh, yeah, that sounds, <laughs> yeah, sounds like a pretty good idea. I think we've got enough exploration of the mine shaft for now, so... And you were right when you said I might come up into another mine shaft when I was digging this tunnel, because I came really close to it, like within ten blocks. Alright. Should I design a harbor? Uh, yeah, you can really build that old harbor. The one in, uh, you can pretty much do it the same way. In fact, the harbor I built is sort of modeled off yours in a way. Problem is, you're going to need more redstone than that, because you need to build the redstone wire. Hmm. I don't know, maybe I'll just build a simple deck right now and then we'll build a harbor at another time. Let's see. Is too wide going to be fine? Well, we should make it uh, four wide. Four wide. Okay. Because you need to put the pistons in and make room for uh, the uh, piston arms. And how long should I make it? Well, that's up to you. That long. That's how long I'll make it. This is an epic... This is a... Yeah, it's hard to... I, like I said before, it's hard to believe we're still in smoothie. Oh, wait, this is only three wide. God damn. <laughs> I fail... Fail potato. Technically, it's a fail potato anyway. I never really understood that. It's another way of calling somebody a failure. It's another way of saying epic yeah. fail, basically. And now the current's all messed up. Well, that's there pretty, are that's well, easily a fixed. Easy way of correcting it. Really, what you gotta do is uh, uh dump in there. 
build it so that the uh, so that the water in the in, in the dock is one block deep. Once you've done that, I, I messed up the current over here to fix the current over there. Uh, oh. Did I fix it? Not entirely. Huh. Well, this is a disaster. Well, uh, if you in the harbor one block deep, that would take care of things. Wait it now. Yeah, right, good. And you put dirt on or something. Let's see here. Just for added security, I'm gonna go to bed and come back and do this. <laughs> Without closing the door like a dumbass. Yeah. Oh, no one's gonna get in. Alright, no one got in. Good. Alright, time to do this goddamn thing. Ah, uh, yeah, that's not annoying at all. Ah, uh, <laughs> flailing everywhere. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Okay, well there's that. Can it, does the shift walking backwards thing work in water? It does. Okay, that makes yeah. it a lot easier. This also makes it easier to wade around, I guess, in this area. There we go. Replace this for consistency's yeah. sake. There we go. I'm kind of curious what this looks like from underwater. It's pretty neat, actually. Can you breathe under it? No. You can't get rid of all the conflicting currents. Yes. The ones over here don't matter too much, so... Alright, time to build a boat. <laughs> Alright. Now... Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the, the first order of business is figuring out which direction I should set sail in. I don't really see anything but islands. There was one area direction I had a, a feeling about before, but I forget which one it was. Oh, this direction. The direction the harbor's pointed anyway. That's convenient. <laughs> Alright, so let's toss the boat in the water. And let's go for a swim. Alright. Here we go. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, 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 okay, here we go. Yeah, I don't know. I can do that. All right, at least we have the coordinates written down. We all live in a yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. We all live in a yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. Now, this is kind of it's kind of neat looking. Underwater formation. We have to be nearing a new, um, a new, a new biome. Yeah. Look at this. This is like a little, um, almost a little natural harbor. Oh, this looks like it might be the start of something. It's really glitching out over there, though. Yeah. Well, this, now my game won't crash if I go there, will it? Well, no, it, it's not. It won't. It's still been in the chunks. Okay, I guess that was just another island. So let's keep going in this direction. Off into the glitchy lands. Oh man, it's strobe time. It's it's the disco ocean. Wow, there really is nothing here. 
Let's start heading in more of a diagonal direction. All right. Wow. Wait. Oh, wait. Oh, oh. Okay, something's being formed over there. Is it just another island, or is it the start of a biome? That's the question. Hmm. The ocean biome is very secluded. You'll feel very lonely there. I don't know, it looks like there's more islands. I'm looking for the first real biome that's not a ocean biome. Well, there's a tree on that island, but one tree on an island doesn't mean very much. Do you think the fact that I've gone so far out and a night might fall before I get back, do you think that's going to be a problem? I don't think mm. so, because unless, because I did just see a monster that can swim. Yes, I'm pretty safe in the water. I've gone more than 600 pixels out. Pixels. You know what I mean. Ah, here we go. Here we go. The There's something. All right. Let's park ourselves here. Uh, jump out of the boat. And let's take a look around. Remember that the boat's down there, because I don't think there's any trees to make another boat. Unless I still have... Yeah, I somehow used up all my wood. I don't even, I'm not even sure how I did that. Yeah, this is definitely the start of a complete biome. Hmm, I collected the cactus without... Well, I might as well take some cactus while we're here. This is a huge biome. All biomes are huge in uh, 1.8 and 9. Oh, wait, I see something different over there. Sheep, I don't have my shears, but I can make shears. Alright, well, we're on the edge of another biome over here, clearly. Hello, sheep. It's It sucks that you're stranded down there. I'm not going to help you. I'm just going to take your wool, but oh well. Me? Help you? Ho, 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 ho. You are funny. No, 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 no. I shear you. Now I do it for the sheer enjoyment of it. Har, 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 har. Yeah. 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 Might this be an, actually an epic mountains biome? It will be the first of its kind in smoothie. I like this. It looks like the head of a horse. Hey, what's going on? Ah! Oh. Ow, I fell. I wasn't paying enough attention to where I was going. What did you say it looked like? Sheepy Hmm. Hello, sheepy. We're gonna shear you. Oh, freaking cactus. I've never actually seen anybody bump into a cactus before. Oh, wow. What? Oh, look. Yeah. Look what I see over there. Look at that forest. Yeah. yeah. I'll have to remember all this, but I'm getting a little bit too nervous about getting too far away from the boat and everything. So we're gonna eat some bread. Yeah. Okay, more cacti. <laughs> yes, uh, I like how the entire cactus falls down when you smack him. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that poor sheep. I, I almost feel bad for him. Almost. And get me out of here! Oh, I feel generous. <clears throat> there. You can jump up and get out now. Not that you're smart enough to actually do it, but at least I gave you the option. Okay. A village is uh, up in the valley in the village, 
And the rules, you can't get into just by jumping, so I cut the, uh, um, well, a couple of the holes in the row, and said, well, we got that. All right. The villagers are smarter than sheep. Of course, as I say, I'm much because I'm a sheep. Sheep are really tight, man. Oh, there goes another UFO. It's time to sail back home. All right. Well, that it was nice visiting that island, but it we must be getting back. All right. If we stay pointed in this direction, it should. And if I look down a little bit, the flashing stops. So that's a, a relief not to have to put up with that. Mm -hmm. All right. Sailing back home. I wonder what's powering the boat. I've always wondered about that. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever it is, it's working pretty well. Look at all these squids. Let's run over some squids. Actually, that's not a good idea. The boat might break. Well, it's not going to be I don't really need squids at this moment, but... Need squid ink? I could use them, I guess, but I'll go squid fishing well, later. Actually, uh, sometimes you'll find that uh, there's like a ton of water in, in a cave so much that a squid has spawned in it. And oh other... yes, I have seen that before. Yeah. You probably haven't seen an under, uh, an underwater anything yet, but uh, sometimes you will know, have, um, like the floor will be completely open in the ocean. Fortunately, however, you can uh, block off the water. Hmm. Are day and night longer now? No. Hmm. Because it seems like it was day for a really long time, and the moon's rising a lot slower than it used to. Well, that's just idle speculation, really. Oh, I see a zombie. Oh, there is home sweet home. Let's park ourselves in the harbor. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> oh. And in we go. And another UFO lands. Well, I honestly think that's probably enough for this recording session. Okay. So, oh my god, oh my god. Uh, skeleton disagrees. How the hell did he get in here? Well, I think if you put your bed too close to the wall, things like that can happen. Either that or, no, it couldn't have happened to you. Skeleton didn't want the episode to end, apparently. Okay, well, now it's daytime, so I hope that everyone enjoyed watching these mini episodes that we made right now. And I will see you all for some more Minecraft action later. So, goodbye. See ya.